Hello there. I'm going to go ahead and show you a quick demonstration of the Vagrant plugin for Jenkins. First, I'm going to go ahead and create a demo job. I already have a Git repository set up for this demo, so I'm just going to go ahead and enter in the file path for that. We'll boot a vagrant box, and I'm also going to color the console output just for kicks. Now, I separated out the provision to a separate step, so you could run things like submodule update or other pre-provisioning tasks that you might need to run. And then we can provision the vagrant machine. And the vagrant plugin also allows you to run scripts as the vagrant user inside of the VM. You can also run scripts as the root user with sudo inside of the VM, but that's not shown in this video. So I'm just going to clone Vagrant itself inside of my Vagrant VM. And we won't build it, we'll just look at it. and now we wait. Unfortunately the uh, the import takes a little while so I'm going to go ahead and fast forward through all of this. Now that the box is online, we run our shell script first, and then we're going to run the provision. In my case, I'm just using a simple puppet manifest that just creates the puppet group and installs the git package. And you'll notice that this is a this is why we enabled the ANSI color output just to make our puppet provisioning look prettier. Then we run our shell script at the end, inside of the Vagrant machine. And you'll notice the path there, home Vagrant, Vagrant. Just a little clue that we're running inside the VM. We've listed inside of that directory. And then at the end of the job, we're just going to destroy the Vagrant VM. And that's it. Thanks for watching.